90.7 TCC, First Class Radio. This is uh, the roots of rock and roll. And on the phone was now from his uh, uh, a palace in Boston, Massachusetts, <laughs> is the lead singer of the Whiptones, uh, Mike Mastalone. Mike, how you doing? Can you hear us? I'm doing great, Bobby. How you doing over oh, there? Very good, very good. We were just running down a little bit of uh, Let East Weekend, and, uh, of course, we had to uh, include you guys. And uh, what a fantastic job you guys did uh, outside, inside, and uh, it was really, really a, a, a treat to see you guys. Uh, how, how was it? Uh, we could, have you come down from the, the high of uh, the big weekend? Uh, let me tell you, it was an absolute blast. We all had a ball. I mean, from the time we got in Friday night to the time we left, Sunday, early, early morning, uh-huh. uh, we were singing nonstop, pouring our hearts out in this music like we do, and our fans and you guys were always there supporting us, and, you know, it's so great, this music, because when we sing it, it's more than just music, it's memories, it's youth, it's childhood, <laughs> it's, it's a passion, you know, and really, and, and when, when I see the look in, in, in the people's eyes, that we're really doing something special for them, and it makes me appreciate it a whole lot more. And on top of that, I have a heck of a lot of fun, let me tell you that. <laughs> it looks like you do. That's fantastic. For all the people out there, we're talking about the whip tones, the young guys, young fellows who we met four or five years ago uh, down in New Jersey. We've actually had them up to one of our shows with the New England Duop Society. And uh, Mike is in uh, college right now at Boston College. Uh, he's down there starting his next uh, second year in, in Boston. And, uh, Mike, how old are you? I'm 19 years old. I'm studying finance at Boston College. I'm a sophomore right now. Yep. And you're absolutely right. You guys were one of the first supporters of us. And in fact, your station was the first to play our music on the air. And the song was Shaboom way back in 2012, yeah. I think it was. That's right. That's uh, correct. Let's, let's yeah. remember I bought your first CD. Oh, yeah. Beach yes, Bob. you did. I Beach, still have that. <laughs> Beach Bob is here. Yeah, he bought the first CD. And our station was the first to play it in the country. That's uh, correct. Uh, yeah, we've been big supporters of you, naturally. And uh, we just love you guys. And uh, we're going to uh, play uh, your new CD here in a minute. And tell us a little bit about uh, uh, about how you come to write this new song called Spin Me back uh where did you get the impetus to the idea uh to write the words for this and uh tell us a little bit about the makeup of the song sure sure well really it started off with the album in general because we knew we were coming back to let and we wanted to release a new product and we have a couple acapella albums already so we wanted to do something a little bit different and on the other hand we always wanted to get a band so just just for just for a few songs or so so we did we got the band together we started recording this album and then the idea came together what if we write an original song? And we went back and forth, bouncing ideas off of each other. And eventually, our baritone, Matt Corson, who does most of the arranging along with me, he, uh, he wrote that song by himself, and he showed it to us, and we're like, you know what? That's perfect. Wow. And, and, and what we really love about that song is that not only is it about the 50s and the music and the cars, but it's about ladies, you know? Yeah. It's about, about coming home to whatever home may be, whether it's, it's your loved one or your car or a better time. Or for us, it was really coming home to let East to our fans and to where we got started four years ago. Fantastic. Now, when you... 